at our summer host pick at HSN. I'm Siobhan Sarna and John Florell is joining me. There's a good story about how we got this to be part of my host pick. It is the first, come out here. It's the first time you're ever getting a chance to see it. It is the slicer that's going to help you to eat those fresh veggies yes. faster. And it is the PL8, the Adjust a Slice handheld slicer. This was unlike any one that I'd ever seen. I had another, <laughs> my best friend, the other Linda, had it in another version and I saw John in the hall. I'm like, oh man, I want yeah. that. Uh, my best friend loves it, la, la, It just la. saves a ton of time in the kitchen. I called his buyer, the person <laughs> who's in charge of bringing these in, and she's like, I know the one you're talking about. I got one that's even better coming, <laughs> and here's the launch of it. Look at that stainless. This yep. visit only. And this is Crazy Flex because it's four months at $7.49, and those expire tonight at midnight. Take us through this if you well, want, Well, here's John. the cool part about this. With mandolins, a lot of people, everybody has a knife in the kitchen, and right. knives do have their place in the kitchen. Yeah. But with a knife, you get one thick slice, then you get a thin slice, then you get a thick slice, then you get a finger slice. With this machine, you get uniform, even slices, but not just for slicing. Okay. It does just about everything in the kitchen that you would ever need. From slicing, dicing, chopping, mincing, shredding, it even Show makes me. french fries. Look at that. Here's the cool part about it, though. This razor-sharp stainless steel blade does all the work for you. But the th nice thing about it, for storage, it's got a storage setting, so you can't cut yourself with this, okay? Thank now, yep. I'm gonna show you this okay. part, because this is the most important part of the machine. It's called the safety holder. Look at that. It's got four stainless steel prongs inside the cup. It's got a plunger button on top. When you push a fruit or vegetable up inside this cup, see how that button pops up? Now, I'm gonna set this to a thick slice, okay. and watch this, because you start at the top, slide it to the table, back up to the top, down to the table. Every slice comes out uniform and even because of the design of this machine. So so it, for pan fries, home fries, raw fries, cottage fries, look at this. You don't waste anything. It takes it to the end, and you never waste anything. And, but all the slices come out exactly the same Precision thickness. Precision cut every single time. <laughs> it's like having your own little personal sous chef in the kitchen. Exactly. So here's probably one of the hardest things you'll ever have to slice in the kitchen, because nobody se ever seems to have a knife sharp enough to slice a red ripe tomato. Look at the safety With this part. machine, you place it in the safety holder. All you do is start at the top, slice it to the table. You can put the machine in a bowl, across the bowl, or you can do this right on the countertop or tabletop. But look at this. It takes it right down to the end and no more fingers, but look at these slices. They're perfect for backyard bar... Here, we're in barbecue season now. Mm -hmm. Backyard barbecued mm -hmm. hamburgers. Look at the size of this look hamburger. Look at that. Here's a two-pound burger. Oh my okay. gosh. <laughs> <laughs> if you've got friends like I have that come over. And we'll show you the onions too because you can't have a burger without onions. That's so right. take an onion. Watch what I'm going to do. Now, if you like... Thick slices, you can slice thick. Okay, but watch how do, this. How do I make it thinner? Right here at the top, okay. there's a little tab. I'm angling you. Can you see that? Way. Yep, there it is. Thanks. There's three Thank different crew? settings. Yeah. Watch what I'm going to do. Push it forward with your yeah. thumb. Push it forward with your thumb, it gets thinner, and then it gets thinner, and then it goes all the way up to your safety, so you can't cut yourself. But if you want a thick slice for homemade hamburgers like this, or for sauteed peppers and onions, mm. or maybe you like them thinner, I want you to see this, because you can slice an onion so paper thin with this machine. Look, I mean, <laughs> these slices come out of this machine so thin. Siobhan, Look here. Look at that, Listen, I can see through it. You can't even smell that, can you? Just say no. 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 <laughs> No. But I'll tell you what, they're perfect for salads, for sandwiches, for sautéed peppers and onions. Here, we'll put those on the burger. And, you know, there here's you the go. cool part about this, all right? Now, here's actually what this machine was originally designed to do over 100 years ago in Germany. They were originally made as a cabbage board for shredding cabbage for sauerkraut. sauerkraut. Okay. You're going to love this on taco night for iceberg Ooh, lettuce. Yeah. Do this with cabbage for coleslaw, hot slaw, pepper slaw, chow chow. And I'll tell you what, the difference, if you don't like your cabbage, coleslaw. Look at that. That's more like shredded wheat it really is. than shredded cabbage. Look at that. But the difference, if you want to change it, watch what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it on the medium slice. That's okay. it. This is the key, guys. Right here? I don't know if you can see the blade move, but as he moves this, yes. that moves. That adjusts the okay, slice. That adjusts okay. the slice. Right here on, on the side. side, watch what happens when I move this one. You'll see teeth pop up right here. Yeah. This does all your dicing and your mincing and your julienning. Can you see those teeth pop up? Okay, watch this. Because now instead of shredding your cabbage for coleslaw, oh, look at you. now you can mince your cabbage deli style, like you get in the restaurants. See? But I want you to look at this because there's not a lump, a hump, or a bump. Look at that. It comes out. It's outrageous. It's perfect. And you know where you'll love this? If you do any cooking at all. Fruit salad. Everybody right? eventually ends up 
mincing onions, right? It's hap It's inevitable. It's inevitable. <laughs> you know, you sit there and play tic-tac-toe? Oh, yeah. Careful with a knife. <laughs> I know. Brand new today, 465-826. We've got the adjust -a slice It's a handheld slicer. It's safer. And yes. that's one of the reasons why I really, really I was so thrilled to have it as part of my host pick. It's for today only. Those four flex payments go away, okay? <laughs> it's just crazy flex. Look at that. You can chop onions so fast you don't even have time to cry. For tuna fish or chicken salad? Have you ever wanted to make a salad? You don't because you have this at home. But have you ever wanted to make a salad and you opened up the, the refrigerator and you thought, you know what, it's gonna, it's just too much. <laughs> Even though it's really not. But, you know, I just don't feel like slicing everything right. up. It, I don't need to make soup because that vegetable's going to go bad soon. Here's the tool that you use to get the most out of the produce that you buy. You know, I hate wasting food. It's one of my pet peeves to be able to get this and maybe you're going to be eating healthier as a result because it's easy. Small batches, big batches. Hey, how about french big fries? Big fries, little fries. <laughs> you see, the difference, I didn't even change this machine. Anything solid isn't going to mince. It'll come out in a julienne spear. So if you want to make french fries for the kids or maybe you want a julienne a carrot for stir fries or for garnishing a salad. When you get close to your fingers, you use that safety holder. You use out the prongs on that safety holder to hold the end so you can't cut yourself. Hey, I'll tell you what, how many of us have ever slipped on one of these old four-sided tin can knuckle butchers, okay? Because that, nothing protects your fingers. That frightens me. I'll tell you what, for the flex pay, yeah. the flex, it's worth it for the for safety holder alone. Even if you have another version of a mandolin slicer, you don't have that safety, okay? You've got the stainless steel blade, it's dishwasher safe. It has everything I think that the mandolin has been wanting to be, that I right. wanted ex exactly in a mandolin, but it's finally arrived. It hasn't been around, now it is. The safety, if you have long nails, you know. The, the, that oh, kind, that, oh, yeah. Mandolins were not for you, right? <laughs> now you have this protector. So it gives you freedom. It gives you back the ability to have consistent consistent slices without having to have knife skills. Now, if you want bigger French fries, okay. all you do is adjust the machine. You see, every time you slide this, see, it slides forward, there's three different settings, and you don't have to remember anything. It's in the instructions, but I want you to see right here, that's super thin for julienne. There's thick julienne, and that's slice, okay? So if you want a thicker julienne, you just push it down one notch. You'll see one row of teeth come up right by the blade here. When I push it up one more, the second row of teeth come up, and make it smaller. So it's so simple and so easy to use. So, uh, but here, I'll I'm tell you what. Aren't you? you want to save time? Look at that. It saves oh. so much time. You can stand it up. You can put it in a bowl. You can put it across the bowl. Or Ooh. watch this. Oh, here, here, How here, much here, time here, here. does celery take to chop? Here, dear. Look yeah. at this. With a knife, it takes forever. For homemade stuffing, come the holidays. Ooh, for soups, for, potato soups, salad. for barbecues, for potato salad, chicken salad, egg salad. Look at that. Look at you that. You can chop more celery in 10 seconds with this machine than you could chop right. in 10 minutes with a knife. Don't you need one of these? Okay, there's the bowl. Yeah. Salad time just got so much it, better. It really Party did. Party time, um, soups, your stews. How about this? Okay. We're going to put the safety holder, the little guide back it's on the machine here. Corn on the cob, it too. It fits over any size bowl. Now, I've got a kind of a larger bowl right yeah. here. If you have smaller bowls you can do that look how about pop three or four radishes into here place the cup the safety holder over the top look what happens you're slicing three radishes at a time without wasting anything you can do cucumbers for pickling you can do radishes mm. apples carrots pears zucchini whatever you like and you adjust the thickness of the slice so I want you to see this though Siobhan yeah I want you to notice these slices I'll pick these up it okay. doesn't matter which one I pick up yeah. because look look they're all exactly they're all the consistent. same thickness so with a knife, what happens? I mean, oh. <laughs> you get one thick, then you get one thin. Yeah. With this machine, they're exactly the same. So for cooking, and especially for doing things like uh, sautéing, if you're going to do onions, or Stir maybe you fry. want maybe Ooh, you want to make potatoes. I love that that shot right there of the platter of grilled vegetables. Yes. Yeah. But right. they're, they're all cooking at the same it's time just like restaurants. because they're all the same thickness. Exactly. So with a knife, you get one cooked, one burnt, one done, one raw. <laughs> okay. How about for pan fries? Home fries, raw fries, cottage fries. Look Brunch at this. At the house. Homemade potato chips. Look at this. Now, this is a medium slice that I have here. Okay. Perfect for homemade pan fries. But look, they'll all Yum. fry up at the same time because they're all the same thickness. If you want them super thin, it's a better way you to do see it. This. It's a better way. The safety, the adjustability, yeah. the 
Uh, hello, darling. There Watch you go. This. <laughs> okay. You want potato chips? Look, you look. You got it. Make you can own. make potato chips homemade. Why buy them in a plastic cellophane gone. bag? You can make them fresh in seconds. Now, here's a tip for you, okay? Instead of putting these in, right in the hot oil, put them in a bowl of cold water for about 10 minutes. All the starch soaks out of the potatoes, yep. so they curl up like yep. a regular potato chip. They get hard, and they don't turn brown, okay, until you put them in the hot oil. <laughs> but watch this. <coughs> How about for cucumbers? Now, if you got a backyard garden, you want to make cucumber salad, bread and butter pickles. You can nickel down carrots for canning, sliced beets for pickling. You make them thin like this, or if you want them thicker or thinner, okay. if you want them super thin. Do you thin, see what's happening? He's not going and running to the pantry and getting another blade, right? <laughs> I know, right. So it's how many of us one. have those blades that we're trying to store or we're worried about it? where did they go? Oh, is the edge showing? Am I going to reach Watch in for this. another bowl and it's going to cut me? Now, oh. instead of straight up and down, try oh, this. I make haven't those seen sand which pickles like you get in the, you John, know you can buy these fantastic. in the stores in the jar but if you're into pickling like I am okay and my grandmother was too she was pickled all the time uh, but I mean <laughs> pickling all the time but you can see when they're all the same thickness they're all they, they, you can hey you know what Here's if these the were pickles let's yeah. put these on this well, burger well actually <laughs> one of my favorite sandwiches is actually a thinly sliced cucumber uh -huh. with some special mayonnaise as instead of lettuce right you're getting more nutrition add yep. lettuce if you want to but try a thin cucumber on your sandwich yummy now, now, here's a tip. Take a bell pepper, take a couple of slices off the end with the stem. Okay. Now you can reach inside, pull the heart and seeds out, okay? Yep. And now you can adjust this to a super thin slice, and I want you to see this because look, for pepper rings, I mean, y there's no way you could do this with a knife this safe, this fast, this thin. And when you get close to your fingers, you have this little finger protector with the guide. That's it. So you can't cut yourself, even if you slip, your fingers are protected. That's Again, it. Again, listen, are your are your fingers worth $7.49? Yes, I think <laughs> I mean, so. You, I mean, think Seriously, about it. Seriously, that's your flex pay, free <laughs> shipping. Uh, th this is what really excited my best friend Linda and myself was the safety feature and this is the upgraded version it's the first time we're ever having a chance to share it with you thanks to the crew for saving this for my host pick because they knew I was totally psyched about it and here's here's the safety you've got a I think less storage to deal with it's a thin profile for um, just sliding in with your other appliances oh those are the appliances that you don't use <laughs> you know those do you have any of those this is the one you will use you'll use it all the time and you'll eat better i gotta and show you this a too peeler with this kit. yes the peeler I, it's worth this it's worth it for the peeler tell I me mean, about that peeler. watch this it's got a little a finger tab on it this is a control knob okay oh. you can use it like a regular peeler and yeah. i want to i want you to see this how great this peeler is because I can literally hold it with two fingers. It peels in both directions, so yeah. it's twice as fast, but it only takes the peel. It doesn't take the meat underneath the peel because that's where all the vitamins and nutrients are, okay? Now, if you want to control it, you have a control knob now, so you can use this what? just by holding this. Watch this. Now you can control it. What, what am I controlling? You, well, look, now you They're can do thicker. perfect thick slices. Oh, you can go perfectly in one direction like this to make all of your little garnishes if you want to roll these up. I have never seen that you before. Can, That's fantastic. But that little control knob, if you've never used one on a peeler, it's amazing. I didn't even know they like, existed, I mean, John. <laughs> you can do all kinds of garnishes with this. I thought it's this a great part was more than good enough, but you're peeler, getting the peeler with it. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't mention that before. And I got to tell you, this. with the machine itself, I mean, we've shown you slicing, dicing, chopping, chipping, shredding. We made we made French fries, You're we made rapping. coleslaw. That's very cool. But well, look at this. <laughs> you can even take corn off the cob, four or five rows at a time. Put it on the thickest slice, and look, at home, use an oven mitt when you do this, because you can, if your corn is hot, you know, if you blanch your corn yeah, first, yeah, or maybe yeah, it's cooked corn. But you can do it raw like I do here, too. But look at this, you get four or five rows off the cob. Instead of using a knife where the corn kernels fly all over the kitchen, now you have fresh sweet corn all winter at brilliant. summer prices. Brilliant, I mean, oh, brilliant. and by the way, Right here. See yeah. what's left on the cob? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use the edge of the machine to oh. milk your cob for your cream style corn, for your succotashes, for soups and stews, Look for chowders. That. I mean, you get three, four, five <laughs> this more machine bites out of does that. more work than any expensive electric machine. <laughs> and I mean, it's a smaller uh, footprint and it's very, very safe. And that's the cool part about it. Look, uh, this is all the room it takes up in your kitchen drawer. Here's a knife. That's it. Here's our machine. 
Mm -hmm. Keep it in your knife drawer. When you see it every day, you'll use it every day. The more you use it, the more you'll love it. To wash it, it's simple. Here, I've got a bucket of water under here. I'm he just going to rinse it. He literally does have a bucket of water over Let here. Let it drip dry. If you have running water at home, it's even easier. We hope you do. <laughs> we hope you do. But that's how simple it is to clean. Okay, you're making your own custom, one minute left. You're making your own custom <laughs> pizzas. Put your mushrooms in there, your banana peppers, you, you, your olives, pitted, of course. Okay, here's the thing. They're going fast. We have a thousand gone, with, and there are even more of you who are ordering it right now, which is great. I'm so happy about this. I hope you're going to eat more of your veggies. I hope you're going to grill them up this summer. I hope you're going to eat the produce that you do have instead of it let, letting it go to waste, or then you have to make soup out of it. It's look. This is an apple. It's brilliant <laughs> for all of your fruits make and your veggies. Make apple sticks for the kids. It's such a great idea. That's why it's part of my host pick, and I want to say thank you to the crew that made that possible. <laughs> this all just happened I mean, hey, because listen. my best friend bought it, and then I saw John in the hall. <laughs> just oh, for slicing alone. Hello, oh, here dear. we go. Hello, Fuji's coming up. Oh. Stand by. One, two, three. Oh, it's nice. There you go. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, I love John. It. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks for and coming. And happy slicing. Enjoy your machines. You're going to love this machine. You are. It's gonna, I bet it's going to be coming. <laughs>